అందరికీ నమస్కారం ఐడ్ లైక్ టు ఫస్ట్లీ థ్యాంక్ ద కాన్సుల్ జనరల్ ఆఫ్ జపాన్ శ్రీ మాసా యూకి తాగాసాన్ ఫర్ జాయినింగ్ అస్ థ్యాంక్ యూ సార్ ఐ డ్ ఆల్సో లైక్ టు ఎక్నాలెడ్జ్ ద ప్రెజెన్స్ ఆఫ్ తాకుయా మోరిసాన్ ద ఎండి ఆఫ్ తైకీషా ఐ డ్ ఆల్సో లైక్ టు ఎక్నాలెడ్జ్ ద ప్రెజెన్స్ ఆఫ్ నావ్యూకి అందుసాన్ థ్యాంక్ యూ ఫర్ జాయినింగ్ అస్ ఆర్ ఆనరబుల్ శ్రీ గరిమెల్ల శ్రీనివాస్ గారు థ్యాంక్ యూ సార్ ఎంపీ డాక్టర్ రంజిత్ రెడ్డి గారు స్థానిక శాసనసభ్యులు కాలే యాదయ్య గారు గౌరవ మాజీ మంత్రివర్యులు ఎమ్మెల్సీ శ్రీ పట్నం మహేందర్ రెడ్డి గారు మా ప్రిన్సిపల్ సెక్రటరీ జయేష్ రంజన్ గారు టీఎస్ఐసి ఎండి నరసింహారెడ్డి గారు టు ఆల్ దోస్ ఫ్యామిలీ మెంబర్స్ ఆఫ్ బోత్ నికోమాక్ Taikisha and also Daifuku I welcome you all to this uh, ground breaking ceremony in fact governor danni aratha kini aratha kini aratha shrinivas gar oka mata japanese lo hini aratha ante mi gatham kante mi bhavishyat baa untundi ane oka vishwasanni kalpisthu edagadam pursuit of excellence anedi japanese culture lo oka antarbhagam ani cheppi varu chepparu sir in fact uh, one of the things i believe is the success uh, in any sphere of life not just in uh, industry or politics or whatever path one chooses in life i think your success will hinge on this one simple philosophy if you are giving if you are able to give that confidence to your investors or to your people that their tomorrow is going to be better than today in your leadership then i think you'll certainly succeed in life my compliments to you on uh, teaching us something truly truly important and japan is a country that i've always admired not now but in fact uh, for a very long time each and every time i visited japan i've come back with admiration respect and a lot of uh, lot of learnings prati sari japan ki velina prati sari ఎన్నో కొత్త అంశాలు నేర్చుకునే దానికి మనకు కనబడతా ఉంటాయి బాగా నచ్చిన అంశం ఏంటంటే మీకు అందరికీ అర్థం కావాలని తెలుగులో మాట్లాడుతున్నాను వాట్ ఐ రియలీ అడ్మైర్ అబౌట్ జపాన్ ఈజ్ ద ఫ్యాక్ట్ దట్ దిస్ ఈజ్ అ కంట్రీ దట్ హ్యాస్ ఆల్మోస్ట్ నెగ్లిజిబుల్ న్యాచురల్ రిసోర్సెస్ నో దిస్ ఈజ్ అ కంట్రీ విచ్ ఇస్ ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్ సెవెన్ క్రోడ్ పీపుల్ ఇట్స్ అ మ్యాసివ్ అబౌట్ ట్వెల్వ్ పాయింట్స్ ఐ థింక్ అబౌట్ వన్ వన్ హండ్రెడ్ అండ్ ట్వంటీ సెవెన్ మిలియన్ పీపుల్ and very limited natural resources it is very very limited in terms of uh, inhabitable area you know because the the natural terrain is very inhospitable for human habitation there are tsunamis there are earthquakes there are many challenges which nature has uh, you know imposed on japan and let us also remember the japan was the only country on the planet which actually had to endure a nuclear attack in hiroshima and nagasaki but the way they bounced back from that despite not having natural resources despite not having precious commodities like land and many other things that typically the rest of the world is endowed with or bestowed with despite the fact that they had to endure a nuclear attack the way they bounced back after 1950s and the way they have actually become a force to reckon with in terms of their economic might today cg let me tell you this any household in india that you can go to if you look around in their drawing room you will certainly find a japanese product it could be a sony t- television it could be you know I, i remember those days when i was growing up when i was a kid we used to have these walkmans you know all the, that used to come in all the way from uh, japan the sony walkmans again you have panasonic you have mitsubishi you have toyota you have honda i mean the list is long the kind of products japan has been able to come out with the kind of world class impression that they have been able to make with their quality is something that we all can learn from i'm sure daifuku and nikoma also will be also will become the leaders in their respective spaces in india i'm delighted that shrinivas garu has chosen telangana despite having options like he said i'm delighted also 
that uh, you have chosen to partner with ITI in Vikarabad. Nenu, kiri kochin tarvata, rendu companies ni kuda adigin dente ente. Mere aidi ondala debhai kotla petu bade bedtu naru. Dada pu padhar ondala nici rendu vel mandi kudyoga le bhotu naru pratyekshanga. Parokshanga dani kanisam mali retim pustai lo kudyoga listaru. Yuvani kuda ma pilal ke stani kanga onde ma Vikarabad jilla pilalu ma Rangare jilla pilalu ma walke Rawali ani adigite. Srinivas Gar Jepin the NTNT You could have Sthanika and Vikarabad the ITI and then already may have adopted Jesus Kunt Namo Jesus Kunt Namo Jesus Kunt Namo Skill Training Ichi Tapakunda Varandar Ni Kuda Tarfi Dhu Nichi Chastamu Tapakunda Varandar Kaukasha Lichi Vithanga Suskunta Vanja Per Srinivas Gar I have to tell you This place where we are seated today Chandan Valley and Sita Rampur I definitely would be remiss if I don't mention the efforts of my brother Patnam Avinash Reddy Prabhakar Reddy Prunava Landaru Kashtapadi Karthik Reddy Garu Kastapadi While under Guda Is Salam Sekar Inche Kraman Lo Patnam Narendra Reddy Garu Kastapadi Is Salam Sekar Inche Tharavathani Ee Roju Inta Pedda Ethnu Industries Ekada Kosta Avunne Wellspan Ekada Undi Microsoft Ekada Undi Pakkana Esther Undi Ekada Japanese Companies Ucchi Nai Amazon Ekada Undi Astral Undi Inka Chala Companies Ipoda Okada Rendu Gadu EV Manufacturers Osta Avunna Aru This Will Probably Become The Most Important Industrial Cluster in the entire state of Telangana in terms of its value that it, that it has been able to capture. So you have chosen very rightly. You have chosen wonderful facility. All I would request of, you know, the Japanese CG as well. CG, you know, I know that Chennai and uh, Pune have had some success in terms of attracting uh, Japanese investments. But Telangana is not going to be left far behind with your support, with the support of the Japanese ambassador. I believe that uh, there's significant learnings for us from the Japanese culture, from everything that you've done, everything that you've accomplished as a country in the last several decades. There's so much respect and admiration in India for the Japanese products and for the Japanese enterprise, Japanese entrepreneurs. I welcome you to in fact set up a Japanese cluster here, not just these two companies here, but I welcome you to invite more large number of companies, large delegations to come in see what we can offer them, see how we can build a beautiful story where even the local entrepreneurs can learn so much from the Japanese way of working. Srinivas was telling me that he will be inaugurating this facility in about 14 months from now. When I asked him how, he said, you know, the Japanese work like a clock. You know, they work as per schedule, as per a timetable, as per a timeline. And he's supremely confident that he will inaugurate his facility next September. I am equally confident that once that happens, we will be able to bring in more and more Japanese companies because they will then realize that Telangana means business. So thank you so much for inviting us. Thank you to both uh, Daifuku and also Nikomak for uh, making sure that this program today is a huge success. Thank you. Jai Telangana.